Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Wednesday, so it's what you reckon on Wednesday. I have a disclaimer. Laundry's gone in the background, <laughs> so uh, I think it's about to spin out, so it might get loud. But uh, I, need, I only have a little bit of time to record today, so I'm going to try to do it now. <laughs> but anyways, this Wednesday I am working on a new whip. Um, it was a upcoming whip last week, but now it's an actual whip. And it's a free pattern called Mrs. Murdoch's Whip Mittens right there there's the picture of they got three sizes it's like preschool child and women's size and i'm sure it's a real simple pattern so i'm sure uh you could alter it easily to fit a man or uh just different hand sizes but it calls for a g hook and approximately 200 yards of worsted weight for the women's size and then less for the child and the toddler size and it does also come with a little pattern for this little star but i didn't do that but anyways i got one mitten done <laughs> Ain't it cute? The cuff is a little bigger than I would like it to be because I know it's going to stretch. But I might just have smaller wrists or something. I don't know. <laughs> but I think it's really cute. I got this done last night. And I got a little bit of room in my fingers and my thumb, which is good so you can move your hands around, you know. But I just decided to go with the strap pattern. And uh, this worked out pretty fast. It just took me a few days to do it because I didn't sit down and work on it. You could probably make these pretty quick in like one setting. But the yarn that I'm using is the Just Yarn from Premier that is at Dollar Tree. Some Dollar Trees. I know not all Dollar Trees have them, but it is the um, Premier Just Just Yarn Worsted. Uh, so it's a dollar ball. And they're both 131 yards each. Number four, and it is mach Machine Wash and Dry, and it's 100% acrylic. Let's see here. The orange is called Marmalade, and the yellow is called Maze. So I'm using a ball of each of those hoping that there'd be enough <laughs> to um it uses you know i'm using a little bit more of the maize color because i'm doing the cuff in it so i'm hoping that i have enough but i do have two scrap balls left and i did start the second mitten just barely last night i just i did that <laughs> so i just barely uh got it going did the very first row but i gotta you start from the cuff and work your way up you make the cuff and then you um start working in the round this way you make the thumb hole and then you finish the hand and then you go back and attach to make the thumb it's a really simple pattern i like it a lot i think it's cute it's gonna be really cute i just hope i have enough but i do have another ball of each of these yarns if i have to i can open it up but uh, i was hoping to try to get a pair of mittens out of the two balls so that um i wouldn't you know i could use them up completely and not have to have a partial skein left over that's what i'm trying to say but i'm brain farting <laughs> But anyways, that's my mitten. I think it's cute. And I decided to make these before the whole Bernie Sanders thing blew up. And then now everybody's making mittens. But um, I just wanted to mittens. Because <laughs> I think they're cute. I had a pair that I made with um, Red Heart stripes, I think. And this part, like, opened so you can use your fingers. But I didn't like that because it kept my, you know, my hand didn't stay warm. Because it was partially open <laughs> so I wanted to make some actual you know whole solid mittens to wear uh, and I'm gonna try them out because it's about to get cold here it's supposed to snow tomorrow or tonight and um, if I like them then woohoo if I don't I'll donate them <laughs> but uh, if I like them I might make Jesse a pair I think he'll like them make him uh, some blue ones or something I don't know but yeah I think it's super cute I like it a lot and I'm, I just chose stripes you can kind of see where the the uh, joins or whatever were the rows but I'm, I'm not even concerned i still think it's cute but uh if i can um get the other mitten out of those two leftover uh scrap balls then i might use the other two balls that i have of this to make a hat or an ear warmer or something to match <laughs> that's what i was thinking to do but anyways that's what i'm working on this wednesday i got to finish up the other mitten <laughs> i don't have to but i want to i'll probably sit down and watch some videos later when i get done recording and stuff and work on that <laughs> but let me know down in the comments below what you guys are working on today or this week and feel free to leave any links to youtube channels or etsy shops or pattern links you know anything like that i just like to see new patterns and i know people other people read my comments so they can um get pattern ideas too but uh let us all know what you're working on and i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys